the same thing, uh, Stephanie, as, as you know, almost the same questions. Uh, so basically, when you were told uh, that you were going to be one of the uh, torch champions for Summerside uh, Intermediate School, uh, during that time that you heard that and you agreed to become, what was going through your mind? Uh, I was kind of like not knowing exactly what it was and just like wanting to get more into it so that I could like understand what exactly we were doing and just going and being able to go down to like City Hall and stuff like that and it was a great experience. So uh, talking about City Hall, um, how did you feel this morning uh, knowing that you were arriving at City Hall and you were gonna, did you know you were gonna meet all the all that media and everything or how did what did you expect? Uh, no I didn't expect really any of that I just kind of thought we were just gonna like sit down and talk and stuff like that and it, it ended up being really cool so it was Do you know you're gonna be on the news today at 6? Yeah. <laughs> um, so how, how, um, how did it feel um, when when you actually received the torch from uh, from from the attorney general, uh, it was kind of like inspirational because like a whole bunch of other people had like held on to the torch and stuff like that, and uh, I just I kind of got more of the feeling of like how like what other people were feeling when they were going with it, and just it kind of gave me like power, I guess if that makes any sense. Yeah, not, it does. But yeah, yeah and, and you know, as, as we always say, that, that uh, you get power from it, but you also put power into it, because all your feelings and passion towards this goes into the torch, and by osmosis, I think uh, people feel that after, you know, knowing, knowing that there's a lot of passion. So when we got to the school, how, what, what, what were your thoughts on how the students uh, were reacting to what they were hearing? Um, well, I thought most of the kids would maybe have more questions, but um, I think a lot of them were really like getting into it and kind of taking it all in at the same time. And there was, I could see maybe a couple that weren't sure about it, but there was a lot of them that were taking it in and probably will be going home and talking about it. So do you think yes, this, these discussions should be uh, more, uh, uh, th they should have more discussions in the classrooms about it? Yeah, I think they should so that people get like even more of a grasp on it and like maybe want to know more by themselves and stuff like that and make the decision and it might be easier for them to choose whether or not they want to become an, an organ donor or if not. Okay, and, and one of the things that uh, you heard today was that Canada has one of the lowest rates of organ donations in the world. Yeah. Did that come as a shock to you? Yeah, I, I would have expected it probably to be in one of like the higher spots, but I, I didn't really know much about it, so I, I guess like it was kind of a shock, but not really at the same time. Now there's some that say that um, this problem could be fixed um, and, and that we don't have to be the lowest, that we could be the highest. Uh, do you agree with Taylor that maybe we should find out uh, about the uh, system they use in Spain to see if it might work here? Uh, yeah, I think they should start getting different ways of trying to raise the organ donations to like a higher spot. Yes, I, I do believe that, yes. And so do you agree that maybe uh, uh, some type of uh, project or survey uh, could possibly be done at your school to find out how all the rest of the students feel about that? Yes, I think we could send like a survey around or something and get people's opinions on it, yes. Well, that would be awesome because if, if your school does do that, I'm sure that it'll influence other s uh, schools right across Canada. and. And you know, and, and you can possibly have an effect on the whole country. So anything you do here at your school uh, could be felt by the whole country. So if you keep that in mind as well. Yeah. Okay. Well, congratulations for a great day.
Thank you. And we'll stay in touch. All right. Okay, bye.